Yeah, the whole world's about to feel that name once again, man. You know? Yeah, how why you how was shy? The destroyer. The almighty. I was shy, a terrible demon like power, man. The destroyer of nations, man. The great judge. Like Thanos. Thanos will go around sitting on a throne. And he would and Thanos, his whole thing was about judging. He was all about judgment, man. And that's what Thanos come in to do, man. The almighty, the all-powerful. That's what those comic books get there from, man. Ezekiel 24 and 9. Then people going to know that there is a God. That's the problem with this world right now. There's no fear of God. That's why there's so much wickedness going on. With these Rothschilds at least worshiping Satan and pushing that satanic evil vibration out. These Edomites, man. Ruling the planet Earth. And the way the Most High going to take them out that throne, man. It's going to be it's going to be violent as all hell, man. He's literally going to blow them out the way. <laughs> like when somebody gets shot with a 12 gauge shotgun There's no coming back from that man At close range That's why Yahweh Shai is coming man The king of kings Yahweh Shai and, that, and then the next kingdom to come Is going to be the kingdom of Israel man Where righteousness is going to rule The king of kings is going to force his father's laws It's going to be a righteous dictatorship In the kingdom of heaven man You devils You Edomites You Rothschilds You're going to see it You're going to see it You're going to be in the kingdom But you're going to be in slavery you, these other heathen nations are going to be in freaking hardcore slavery, man. Serving the children of Israel. Serving our Lord and Savior, man. And serving and serving his servants, man. The 144,000, the house of David. By Ezekiel 24 and 9. Therefore, thus saith the Lord Yahweh, woe to the bloody city. I will even make it the power. I will even make the power for great, for the great. For, I'm sorry, Salakia. I will even make the power for, fate, for fire great. The pile. And this place is a pile. Of, this place is nothing but a pile of shit, cesspool, wickedness, chemtrails. The food's poison. People's minds are poisoned. You can't even have sex without having to worry about it, uh, having an STD. You can't even have. You can't even bust a nut in peace, man. <laughs> That's hell, man. In the kingdom of heaven, you're gonna have no condoms. You're gonna have none of that bullshit. These STDs, these diseases, GMOs, Monsanto. You're gonna have airplanes spraying chemtrails, man. You're gonna have no television with uh, transgenders and homosexual. Homosexuals being ran pushed down our people's throats, man. This wicked ass music, man. You know, it's the kingdom of heaven is going to be peaceful, man. Why? Because the righteous are going to rule. When the wicked are in authority, the people mourn. When the righteous are in, the, are in authority, the people rejoice. And the people are going to rejoice. The animals are going to rejoice. The trees are going to rejoice. And the whole world is going to see how to rule. How is it to rule a, a righteous kingdom? Which is what? The laws of the heavenly father, man. Which is going to be perfectly instituted in the kingdom of heaven. Heap on wood, kindle the fire, consume the flesh, and spice it well, and let the bones be burnt. As in Most High is the chef, man. He's preparing the meal. The recipe is preparing the meal to burn up America like a grill. Here it is summertime, right? People like summertime, like the charcoal, like to barbecue. Well, America's going to be a barbecue, man. Then set it empty on the coals thereof, that the brass of it may be hot, may be hot, and may burn, and that the filthiness of it may be molten in it, that the scum of it may be consumed. And America's scum. That's all America is scum, man. She have worried herself with lies. Her great scum went not forth out of her. Her scum shall be in the fire. And that's a beautiful way for America to go out, man. Kolo Yehawba Hashem Yahushai. He's about to be get judged, man. Yeah, and the prophets seen the destruction, man. They seen the destruction. They seen the mushroom cloud, man. They seen it, man. That's in the scriptures, man. I don't believe in the Bible, man. Who gives a fuck if you don't believe, man? So what if so was so what if some do not believe? Is it because you don't believe in what the prophets of the Lord are saying, what we're saying? You don't believe in these videos that's being pushed out through the Spirit of the Lord, through the Spirit of Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shai? Does it mean that America is still not gonna be judged? Does it mean that America is still not gonna go into Thor's war? 
Third World War doesn't mean that America's not going to attack Iran and Russia's going to blow America to kingdom come, to our kingdom come. Because when this place goes down, we're coming up, the nation of Israel, man. And these devils know this, man. These Rothschilds, they know this, man. Revelation 6 and 14, the heaven and the heaven departed as a scroll. You roll up a scroll. And the heavens departed as a scroll when it was rolled together. And every mountain and island were moved out of their place. Because this destruction is going to be sick, man. This destruction is going to be sick. The missiles are actually going to shake the earth to and fro, like it says in Isaiah 24. People are going to fear Yahweh, Yahweh Shai. The whole world's about to fear. And that's what's needed, man. The fear of God, literally, is needed on this earth. This earth is fucked up right now, man. It's fucked up, man. It's full of scum. That's why the Lord's going to clean it out with fire, with nuclear fire, his weapons of indignation. Those bullets, those missiles are his bullets, man. He's ready. He got the shit in the chamber, cocked back, ready to go, ready to blow. His bitch away, man.